and welcome to our main channel video which is the news Q intro intro <laughs> so, what are you doing? Are you going to go first, Bex? Or me? Yeah, I don't know what that's fine. Go on then. So, I've got six. No, I have five because I've got right. I, and I know we're getting damn desperate. Mm. So, this is in Sheffield in the South uh, Yorkshire area, if you can speak. So, hundreds of more. Morning, morning, morning. Mourners. Mourners. <laughs> have attended the funeral of teenage Leon Weeks who was stabbed to death last month. She was just 16. It's a lot of 16. Terrible death. Disgusting. I am, for my first, is Tarbot Palmer Tompkinson who died. She was aged 45 years old. It's funny mm -hmm. that. Tar Palmer Tompkinson is a, what they call an, an it girl. She was a um, London society girl who once around in posh clothes and was posh and sorted about basically. Uh, a buggler. But it's a shame. 45. Do you know that? They're not kidding out how she died and it's not suspicious but that's just dead. She was cooking and was up previously. We didn't know she went back to it. So there you go. Next, this is technology. This is school children in England will be offered lessons in cyberbullying in a bid to find the experts of the future to defend the UK from attack. And the uh, lessons will take place for school children in 14 upwards. Mm -hmm. I think that should be a good idea. No, it's kind of a good idea. Actress Joan Brown, who's now 90, and Doc Cotton, she's she's 90. Yes, is still going strong and says that she won't believe in East End, but she can't afford to. And she says that she's happy doing it. Yeah, she enjoys it, she loves it. So there you go. She's still acting. Carry on. That's what I said. Yeah. Next, this is Bill Cosby's television. This is the 70th BAFTA film on Earth, which is currently on tonight. I think it's already on. She wasn't meant to be taking that. It's not on tonight. It is. It's not. It is. What station is it on? I don't know, but it's, it's on not on our TV. It's on tonight. Is it? Oh wow. Um, <laughs> it's the same thing for us tonight, but it be yesterday for you guys. Um, it's underway with La La Land, which some people love it and some people hate it. I've not seen it. I've not seen it and they don't like it. Not seen it so quick. I can't even answer you. Um, in, in the morning for a record breaking haul. I think it's the most Oscar, Oscar awards. Most Can awards? No. Well, I've got body cameras and t shirts. Good idea or bad idea? And so that down below. Body mm. cameras. Body cameras. Which I say, good idea. Let them say from the schools no more. Mm. What with people now, these people from that art and centre fighting, urty teachers. There's just no respect. stop respect, no respect, there's no, no stopping up. When I was young, when that's I was last, <laughs> when I was last, that sick up, hey, and do you know what? We was well behaved children in school. Might have been not too hard, <laughs> very well behaved in school. Because that scared us. Knowing that was in that corner scared us. So we was good. So there you go. My next is under the section children. I've got a children one. And this is the number of under 16s. This is good news. Under 16s who were killed or murdered in England, South Wales has fallen to its lowest since records began in 1972. Brilliant. Good news. Yes. That. Good news. Thumbs up. I've got a bit of news. Good news. Earlier finishes for well behaved pupils. So if you're all good, we sit there and we go on at uh, 10 past nine. When well, school starts at night, feel good. And all those bad people, the naughty people, from R3. Mm, don't think that's going to work. No, because if you go in at 9 o'clock and you're good for 10 minutes. No, I meant I was being sarcastic there. 
I was saying that good, good children, good behaviour pupils go on like, um, not good ones, don't go on there like. I suppose it serves them right now, doesn't it? But it's just going to cause too much trouble at the year. I was good and they, they were misbehaving miss and, and they've got me into trouble miss and oh dear miss, not working. I don't agree uh, that My one. next one is again NHS related. I'm not surprised there, but yeah. Right, no. Excuse me about my miss. I'm just hit it. Um, surgeons in England have been in the special chains kicking the heels. As I like that. Um, bed shortages to this. So operations are being cancelled due to bed shortages. So basically, people aren't got a bed. So if they want to uh, need to go in for an operation, they basically can cancel it because they don't have a bed for the recovery afterwards. That's right. Yeah. Which I yeah. think is that might pointless, but because if it's like a life threatening thing and they really need to I think they'll go into emergency treatment, so then what's got a pull in eight? Well, get shuffled out, and then what's got an art fair? And then what's on Jeff's door? Matt had picked up top at this, but not the one that I still think that is that sweet that we need more people, or not more people, need more beds, or even that we build. It out more. More hospitals. More hospitals. More hospitals. Bigger. Extend the hospitals. Right, you should be four beds in the middle of that. Six. Yeah, extend them. See that, right? My last one is blind dates coming back. Oh, that's the only thing I can see because I don't want to switch it, by the way. So, the blind dates is coming back. Person of black, she died in 2015. Yeah, she was 16. Passive, but one of the sons actually, I just read it paper, one of the papers this week, one of the sons has actually said that Vicky, Vicky, Vicky Patterson, Vicky Patterson, yeah. is going to do a very good job of taking over Silver Black, so there you go, no, no, is it Vicky Patterson, people said it was a merge, no Vicky Patterson at the moment is going to do it, don't know yet, don't know, yet. I don't know. I so, know. Um, I might know, I celebrity, oh, actually, if I've got a get me out of here. Uh, what um I do is um I can't like with names I like to see the faces to put name to it. Alright, well then right. yeah, she's so I know it if I have a Google and face. Right, but then yeah, she's going to do some of that job, which she can't do no more. She has to do uh, surprise she surprise. 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 surprise surprise. Right, Ollie, Ollie will it be does that now? So that's my news. My do last that. one is. A mother of a 10 year old boy, Big Odson, says she feels incredibly sad and helpless over a two year wait for treatment. Disgusting. Uh, so basically she did everything she could possibly could to get treatment for a 10 year old. But because not the right age, uh, there's not enough um, people on board. And that's the reason. They couldn't have treatment, which I think is. Not enough nurses, not enough doctors, not enough psychologists, not enough, not enough mental health people, just not enough. That's what my problem is at the moment until April. Yep, there we go. She's so annoying. But, yay. That's it for mine, actually. Yep. So if you. So if you guys did enjoy this main channel video, excuse Richard, then please don't give it a massive oh, thumbs oh, up. <laughs> Comment down below. Um, your thoughts and opinions on the news, or if you've got any news, and that's no down below. Yeah, no, I shout it out. No down below. And I'll shout your name out in my next vlog. Also, subscribe for daily videos and main channel, channel videos. And it's just with my mum. Ring the bell. 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 